Okay, so last time grade 9 diniskus na natin yung uh, quadratic equations, no? So ngayon magbibigay ako ng examples of quadratic equations in the form of ax squared plus bx plus c equals 0. So this is actually called the standard form of this equation. Standard form. Okay. We're in ax squared is the quadratic term then meron siyang squared then you have bx as your linear term quadratic term linear term then c is your constant term okay so, these are actually real numbers. Yeah. So, these are the terms used in the equation x squared plus bx plus c equals 0. Now, I'm going to have examples of quadratic equations. Okay, our first example, we have 2x squared plus 5x minus 3 equals 0. So, this is already written in standard form. ax squared plus bx plus c equals 0. So, all we have to do is to get the values of a, b, and c. So, we have a is equal to 2, b equals 5, c equals negative 3. So, that's it. Those are the answers. So you have to get the values of A, B, and C. Okay. Next example we have 3x times the quantity of x minus 2 equals 10. So you will notice that this is not yet in standard form. So what we're going to do is to make this like this one. x squared plus bx plus c equals 0. So, all we have to do is to distribute 3x inside the parentheses. So, we have to multiply 3x. 3x times x, that is 3x squared. 3x times negative 2 is negative 6x equals 10. Now, you will notice that 10 is on the right side. So we have to uh, transpose this to the left side by adding the additive inverse of the constant to make this 0. So that is 3x squared minus 6x. The additive inverse is the opposite of this number. So since this is 10, so that is negative 10 equals 10 minus 10. So, the additive inverse of 10 is negative 10. That makes this right side equal to 0. So, the final answer is 3x squared minus 6x minus 10 equals 0. So, this is now already in standard form. So, the value of a is 3. b is negative 6. And C is negative 10. Okay. Then, third example, we have 2x plus 5 multiplied by x minus 1 equals negative 6. So, all we have to do is to multiply this binomial by this binomial since that is not yet in standard form. So using the FOIL method, so we have 2x times x, that is 2x squared. 2x times negative 1 is negative 2x. 5 times x is positive 5x. 
Then, 5 times negative 1 is negative 5. Equals negative 6. Okay. So, we have to add like terms. So, negative 2x and 5x. So, we just rewrite 2x squared. Negative 2 plus 5 is positive 3x minus 5 equals negative 6. So, we're not done yet. All we have to do is to make this negative 6 equal to 0 by adding the additive inverse of negative 6, which is positive 6. So, just rewrite 2x squared plus tx minus 5. The additive inverse of negative 6 is positive 6 equals negative 6 plus 6 to make this right side equal to 0. So the final answer here will be 2x squared plus 3x. You add first this one, negative 5 plus 6, that's positive 1, equals negative 6 plus 6, that is equal to 0. So this is now in standard form. Then we can get now the values of a, b, and c. So a is 2, b is 3, c is equal to 1. So that is how to write the equations that are not yet in standard form of quadratic equations. So as long as it will be in the form of ax squared plus bx plus c equals 0, that is the standard form. So all we have to do is to get the values of a, b, and c, which is the numerical values. Okay? So that's all for now. Thank you for uh, listening.